and my skin has been really dry <laughs> my eyes has been really dry that's probably why that is happening <laughs> hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel this video did not was not supposed to go this way and yeah now this is how it's gonna go so i missed the video last was it Thursday? i was really busy so i could not post so i didn't have a chance to post it so my face is puffy so all my eyes are swollen i'll get to that anyways today is the fifth week of acutane and here is my progress and let me cover the eyes okay so um since my last peeling um i'm sure you guys can see like my face is clearer it's brighter so and this side is almost completely clear but i feel some tiny tiny things inside i'm not sure what's going on and this one has been there since last week friday no oh, sorry last week monday and it's still there but it's leaving but it's really taking its time i don't know why okay so and um yeah i think that's all then this guy is new is it new i really don't know because it's not paying me but i feel like it's new because i've not noticed it before then there is this ones this one's here mm -hmm. they're new all of it just this guy is new then this ones that are supposed to shrink most of it has actually shrink this one i feel it shrinking there was one huge one here that is now completely gone and um, just the color it's that that really remaining now my side effect still is my chapped lips i still have some use this guy every time every time i just washed my face again so yeah i have to use that guy every time i'm so sorry i have to look fine for you guys because my face is my face already looks like shit and um my chapped lips and my back pain it just comes and go and when it comes it's very it's very very bad but then i remember to drink water and it gets better it just get there and my skin has been really dry <laughs> my eyes has been really dry that's probably why that is happening because everything is sensitive and all but this one is really painful and it's refusing to go i still don't know what it is and i feel some picking under the skin i really don't know what's making it to break out but i feel like it's because i took um mayonnaise and butter a lot this last week this last few weeks because i wanted to use them i was trying to use my acutane with fat and oil and that's like what i could think of so yeah that's probably one of the causes and what again just to see very well what else that was really all let me think is there anything i want to oh happy eid mubarak to my muslim people congratulations to you all happy celebration i can't wait for my meet today i was disappointed there is this family that every seller we always go to visit and it's like guaranteed i'm so sorry for this guy i just have to 
<laughs> guaranteed um guaranteed guaranteed enjoyment guaranteed meat and all of it and yeah there goes the blood and i've been trying to call the family throughout the day and they're not picking up i already told everybody everybody was already like oh yeah the usual we're going to this place we're going to this place my lips are really dry and then today came and boom nothing nothing no meat nothing i've been at home throughout the day i did not step outside oh i did step outside of my house but i'm getting to that so yeah no meat for me for today or maybe tomorrow i shall receive meat maybe tomorrow as you all know my eyes is the most sexiest part of my person don't look at that don't take a look at this one sexy and now i don't know what that i don't know what's going on here i don't know what's going on i know this so in the beginning in the beginning beginning let me tell you guys a story my dermatologist told me not to enter the pool because maybe the bacteria in the pool caused my face to break out a lot or caused it to start breaking out a lot then i then she advised that i should not have food for at least the first month you guys know the first month is over like i could i was excited i was like i like entering the water a lot so when the one month was over when i went for my um clinic um, review and I asked her if I could enter the pool and she's like yeah sure that she does not think the pool can penetrate through my skin anymore because there is like no active acne all the ones that are active are not open so that yeah I can go back to the pool I'm not really excited and I did not enter the pool honestly until she told me to so yeah I asked that to be so long God help me so then um, um i came home and i was all excited excited i told my mom like mom i can enter the pool and she's like nah don't enter the pool let's just see how we go i'm like no i must enter the pool she's like if you enter that pool i am not pay for any of the treatment anymore if anything happens to your face because we I'm the one going through trauma, but she like went through it with me, so I kind of understood her. So that was yesterday. Yesterday I was I was really adamant, like I really wanted to go to the pool, but then she said I shouldn't, so I just didn't go anymore because you know our Nigerian mothers can be. So today my friend came to visit. She's a doctor, and. We went to the same secondary school. She's one of the people I said is to come to Priscilla when I should be a change person. So I wanted to like let's have fun. Like, there's nowhere to go and eat me, so let's go somewhere and have fun. So I felt like okay, let's go to the pool. And this time I did not ask anybody because I felt I'm a grown up. Who let the accept I'm sure from I'm a, I'm my own woman. I can take off myself. So as I went to the pool, three o'clock, it was around four, four-ish. So normally I have to spend about one hour, 30 minutes at the pool. But today I was just excited, like it's been so long. I wanted to just stay. So I was at the pool. I tried to teach her to swim. This stupid girl almost drowned but we survived because people were there. <laughs> that did not teach me enough lessons to get out of the pool. We still continued swimming. Then people came and joined us. Then we started playing a game, catch the ball in the pool with other guys, big, big guys. So, I feel like I should explain how the game is. Okay, so we're six. Five people are playing catch. There's one person in the middle that isn't supposed to touch the ball. <laughs> it's a stupid child play. And it's not like it's normal game that we play anytime we're even in the pool, even with my brothers. So like it's not it's just a game. So then um so we're playing, we're playing, we're having fun, it's so sweet. And then anybody that 
they throw the ball to and doesn't catch it and it's the person in the middle that catches it the person moves to the middle and i didn't want to move to the middle so when they threw my ball at me i didn't catch it but the person in the middle was about to catch it so i ran there he didn't see me coming i was behind him so when he caught the ball he threw it to the back like when he caught it like he wanted to show everybody that oh i already caught the ball i'm no longer in the middle and he was excited he didn't even see me or anything then he just used force because it was inside the water so you have to use force and push the ball i was on top of him like he was inside the water like this and his head was out like i was on top like this so when he brought it down to the back it and just and he had long fingernails i mean long and when they brought so I was on top, I was just on top like this. It's not like this. And, ah, good explanation is that. So then, as that happened, his hand came and did it. It entered my eyes, guys. It entered my eyes. And I could not see anything. Everything was black. Okay, what I felt first was pain. It was very painful. Like, it is still very painful. It looks terrible. I'm scared. I don't even know, but let me just keep going. So, um, I felt still the pain, and I was inside the water, so I could, I could not open my eyes, so I didn't really know. Then I just held it like I felt, you know, when you eat somebody, it pains you first, then it just leaves. That's why I thought it was, but it wasn't that. I could not see my eyes. I was in the pool, so I did not know what was going on. My friend, the doctor that was with me, when she, I started screaming like my eyes, my eyes. Then I came out of the water. It's when I came out and I could not see anything. I started panicking because everything, okay, I could see with this eye, but then I covered this eyes and you know, it's, it's actually blue. Then I covered this eyes and I was trying to like see if I would see because it was says I was feeling the pain on and I didn't see anything. It was black everywhere was black everywhere was black guys everywhere let me go that way so then i don't think anybody really saw what was going on because i was kind of holding holding then she, my doctor friend now came out then she like told me to remove my arms and she saw that blood was dripping blood was dripping from my eyes guys blood it was little dripping and it was scary but i did not know then she was like oh my god there's blood in eyes and everybody was like blood, 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 blood. and everybody got out of the pool tending to me it was scary i was scared then i had to stay on that water and then i think there were about two people that were doctors there so they were like no worry you'll be fine it's just uh, blood in the eye you need to go something 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 yeah something 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 just store all those medical terms that I do not know. So then the step point was in my eyes so that to clear out because they could not really see anything because my whole eyes was filled with blood. So then I stayed under the shower and then the blood started clearing. Then I started seeing. Then I started seeing and um it was still blood, it was blood red i don't know how to explain it but okay now it's clear but that time it was really blue and so then the doctor oh, that's doctor she now came she now said i should look to the left looks to the right then when i looked to this side she now saw that it was actually bad this was worse than what they had thought it was so then everybody was like oh my god oh my god yes i i was scared because i didn't know what was going on i could not see but their expressions were scaring me but i was happy because i could see i could see them it was blood but i felt like okay i can't see you guys so i was relieved but then they were screaming and shouting i'm like um what is going on what is it like what happened so um then the doctor went to call my mother. If you were following me, my mother told me not to enter the pool. I did not tell her I was going to the pool. I just stepped out and went to the pool. 
so she went to tell my mom and i'm like please don't tell her i don't know what i was thinking like i still have to tell her anyways so when she was going i had to just follow her because i know how my mom can be and she does she has every right to be angry because she told me what to go to the pool and i went i went i went at coconut head and went to the pool so then when i saw her i think my friend might have exaggerated the matter a little bit she said my eyes was pouring out blood i did not see what happened but i doubt it that one from that i doubt it because the opal will have food blood if that happened so i don't think that happened anyways my mom came she was screaming at me she said if i tear shout or cry <laughs> he was laughing <laughs> Oh my god, she was so angry. She did not want to feel. I didn't even want to move near her. Because now African mothers can be. I will know it. You will think something wrong. She just land you at. So then she looked at us and she's like, oh, It's not so bad. It's not bad, it's not bad. You know, she just tried to calm me down, calm me down. And I'm like, Okay, okay, okay. And I didn't cry anything. I was just screaming. I don't think I could even cry. I think maybe the tears could never even come. Oh, actually, it could. I've come to come, but I didn't cry. If I the tears could never come, please. I was just afraid. So then we went to the clinic, and the doctor saw it, and he's like, "Wow, this is bad. What happened?" And I'm like, "Why would you say this is bad to me? That's already panicking. I don't want to know that." Then it just did like this. Ouch! It's so hard to blink and it's like mm, okay i'm going to give you drugs i'm going to give you eye drops i'm going to give you I don't know, I'm this i'm going to give you that so they prescribe drugs for me i'm using eye drops and a cream inside my eye i've not used that one yet, but i've used the eye drop the blood did not stop until i think i don't know that's why i've been using this because i'm trying to clear it up because when it is kind of full it's not bleeding but maybe it's water or the eye drop but she is blurring my vision like now so i have to like clean it start off so that it's lean then i can see properly yeah but i'll be fine because do you know what i'm scared of do it do what i'm happy about i'm happy because if you guys see it's kind of close to my pupil. This pupil, they call it, yeah. Mm -hmm. Because if the nail had punctured my pupil, we will not be having the same story. So I'm so grateful to God. I am happy that it was not close to. But it feels like my eyes are swollen. I don't know. It feels swollen, but I don't know if it's actually swollen. Everybody has access, like it's not swollen. But as I'm blinking like this, oh my God, it's so painful. But then the thing I'm scared of is it shouldn't leave a scar in my eyes. My eyes are like the sexiest thing in my face. Okay, this one is red because I opened it down inside the pool. So maybe like tomorrow evening to be clear. But this one, this other one, I don't even know if putting it close to the light is helping. Oh, it's good, sorry. So, yeah, guys, that's basically it. So, let me see. This place, clear. Nah. I'm not so sure. But, like, I can't move my eye. But I just feel like bumps on that. Nah, this, is, this is the guy I'm scared of because I remember them treating this. I remember, like, even the last time I did this video, this was not there. So I'm trying to think is my face still purging or did I do something different? Or did I eat the UE product and I was now aware of it? Because I'm just going to like watch what I eat. Oh, and by the way, the drugs they gave me, I have to use it four times a day. Four times a day. And the one that I have to apply into my eyes kind of contradicts Accutane. So I don't know what I'm going to do with it. 
I already used my first dose of my eye of my eye drug. But I think now I'm going to use the Accutane. The next dose for the eye stuff is by 2 a.m. Okay, the time now is um, 9, 9, 10, 9, 12. So, that's, and I used the eye drug. But that one doesn't interact with Accutane, so I think I can just use it. I just have to drink a lot of water. So then when I use the Accutane, but what I don't know is... The one that I have to apply in my eyes is only the oral one that the oral one that interacts with Accutane. I don't know if the cream would also interact with Accutane. I'm not sure what to do. I don't want to ask my dermatologist because she'd be like, why are you always using drugs? Because the last time I had my hair, I have to use drugs. I think after this one, I have to really, really avoid Anything that has to do with drugs, honestly. Hey, I've seen a difference between the skin of my hand and my face. Where will my face look like the skin of my hand? I cannot wait. It's on the way, actually. It's on the way. It's almost there. I think my face is just white now because I just washed my face and everything is just dry. Anyways. You guys should wish for quick recovery so that I can make next video my other three videos are probably going to look like this so uh was it two days ago we went to the park and we, i was running up and down i um uh, i rode bicycle i played a lot a lot guys a lot and then i woke up monday morning and every part of my body was paining me god like these are things that i normally would do and nothing will happen but i don't know if it's because of the drug and now it's fine today's tuesday and my body aches more yesterday i could barely raise up my arm and i just did arm wrestling blah 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 i rode bicycle i did race that's like okay and i rode horse I think that's all I did and I woke up yesterday and my entire body was pinning me down to my wrist so I I think that because there are no there's no oil or the oil is drying my joints were just um, acting up but today I'm fine yesterday my brother had to give me a massage because I asked them because we all did this thing together and I'm like is your body paining you at all and they're like no nothing of such so why is my own difference so i figured probably a kitten that did that so yeah joint pain that's when i when i stress myself so much oh my god my eyes aches guys sorry my eye aches guys it's really painful i can't wait for you to go I saw that there is about week five. I'll see you guys week six. And somebody asked me, or so people have asked me, not online, personally, that watch my video. They're like, is it only a I've been using? And am I using any tropical thing or anything? So, my next video is going to be on my Aquitaine. Accutane what? Tropical treatment. Yeah. That's what it's gonna be on. It might not be this week, it might not be this. But I'll do it. I'll share it so you guys can see. And I'll also make a video of all the other products that I've used that have worked for me. That have really, really worked and those that didn't. You guys should look forward to it. Alright. Peace out. Wait. Oh no. If you're a new subscriber, she's subscribe. If you're a new subscriber or you're just watching my video for the first time, please hit the subscribe button. I think I had over 200 likes in the previous, previous video. And I didn't have one subscriber. I didn't have just a single one out of 200. I didn't have one subscriber. 
that's terribly bad so you guys should please subscribe to my youtube channel so you can see more of my black eye if you're interested and my progress because that's important that's but right now i think it's just this guy that needs to leave then and this then my face to be the peeling is not quite done my neck is still peeling and just around my foil here is still peeling so anyways please like subscribe and um, comment the comments are really important cool. i'm so tired <laughs> So I have to make this video because I don't want to miss this posting today. So, peace out guys. Again, please, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Bye.